Come on. Jeez, Taylor actually seems concerned about Kate. I don't know. Let's see. I hope you burn bright again soon, Kate. Oh, that's our room. We don't need to go there. Nothing here. Nothing. Nothing there. Nothing here either. Victoria is about as straight as me, but she really appreciates style. Those boots are made for walking runways. My cookies? Victoria stole my cookies. <gasps> now I can't take them back because she'll know I did it. Oh my god, what a Victoria, bitch. <laughs> these socks cost more than my wardrobe. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. <sighs> Victoria must have her own power if she found time to steal this from my room. Good job. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Trash can. That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Huh. Victoria's secret. She's a geek. Glow in the dark blue period. And of course, her laptop. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. Doesn't anybody here use... This is like a thread for sociopaths. Passwords? Max Crackfield? Lame. Party on, dudes. The team out with Max Crackfield. Mm. First Rachel and now Kate? This is the end of the Vortex Club. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. <sighs> Nothing to see here. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. Color me impressed. Wait, are you telling me there's nothing to photograph here? Hmm. Right then. Okay. I still need to find the photo. Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. Hmm. Well, that's the same thing. Dana looks guilty and relieved about Kate. She really does Hello. care. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Well. Hmm. 
Yes. I'm gonna leave. I mean, the photos are not So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. Ah, okay, now I think I've. Oh, shrooms. Oh, that's not the room. Oh. I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. But I feel kind of invincible now. <gasps> yeah. Anything else to say, or should I just get up? Okay. Let's, let's go see if we can take a picture of... Oh, the most magical insects. Burn bright. Squirrel. Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Samuel isn't around. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Hmm, yeah. <laughs> fashion and bolts. Right. Like my grandpa's garage. Nothing here. Once again, about the squirrel. No. Broken lamp. Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. Maybe. <laughs> oh, hello. No. The Tabanka does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. Mm. Make art, not war. Mm. No. Not supposed to take any pictures here. Right. Principal Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Okay. Blackwell on the ball. Maybe. I don't know. No, no, no. Yep, I, I didn't want to do this. No. <laughs> I feel so giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Was take a picture of him jumping. Nope. Okay. Um. Well, now we 
go here again. Max the ninja strikes again. Get it? Boo, yeah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Oh. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Well, yeah. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plans. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Chaos Theory. Didn't you say that it was all about Chaos Theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, yeah. I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Nathan expelled. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody. Even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... No, uh... Kicking it? Kicking it in Los Angeles? That would be the best case scenario. She wouldn't leave without me, okay? And how often do missing girls turn up? We have to find Rachel soon. Not that often, yeah. We have to. That's, that's I true. promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, Step Prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so yeah. glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert grown here. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Yeah. I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from... Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. And, uh, yeah. I haven't picked a winner yet. I you hope he hasn't seen words, her so entry. So it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor.